Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Rajas Kakasungura YouTube channel. William Samoy Ruto had a meeting with all the newly appointed cabinet secretaries and uh, all the principal secretaries from across all ministries. And um, things are tough. Apambele. And every principal secretary must prepare his life for exit. The government of national unity is going to frustrate families and individuals. When something happens, there is its positive side and there is its negative side. On this one, the meeting at the State House with principal secretaries and cabinet secretaries might be the last supper meeting with some of the principal secretaries. William Ruto spent his time lecturing the CSS why they have no option but to perform. He also took time to lecture the principal secretaries on the need to have one option and that is only delivery. When cabinet secretaries were being interviewed or were being vetted, some of them raised concern that uh, principal secretaries are the engine of ministries. So if a ministry has a wrong PS, if the ministry has an incompetent PS, even if a cabinet secretary is qualified, that ministry is bound to fail. So the new cabinet secretaries laid blame and said the last cabinet might have failed due to an incompetent principal secretaries. Here, William Ruto has said he has formed a government of national unity. Then, he must, he must also make the executive that includes the PSS have the face of national unity. What is going to be done? Just like William Ruto dismissed all the cabinets to include the ODM ones, there is one that is also plotting to fire all principal secretaries once the cabinet secretaries fully resume office, wakishika ile joto ya ofisi. Then I want to tell you, all principal secretaries are going to be sent home. And a new list will be formed. At this juncture, it only depends your alignment with either Raila Odinga or William Ruto. So, today, I heard Silvana Zosoro saying, in front of the president, in Kisi, the way in Yamira, na alisema, kwamba na aliongea kwa kikisi, kuna nafasi zinakuja za principal secretaries. Osoro aombe kidogo, za William Ruto, Simarati aombe kidogo, za Raila Odinga waweke pamoja wasaidiane kama ndugu na dada that statement tells you what already the plan to send home principal secretaries is underway and this is bad news 12 principal secretaries i am made aware that it is in the public domain that some principal secretaries spent millions to lobby for those positions. 
what is going to happen? The PSS Wengi, some of them, they bribed to get those positions. Muliona katika gazeti ya testandard, miezi ambayo imepita, kwamba in kisi, a few individuals collaborated to steal from a candidate who they had promised to give a PS job. Mulisikia majina prominent ya kitajo kwa hiyo story. So, third story is a confirmation and an indication that principal secretary, some of them used up to a tune of 10 million for their name to be suggested to William Ruto. So, ladies and gentlemen, the pressure is awaiting some individuals. Hmm? Stress is awaiting some individuals. Imagine you spend 10 million in lobbying for that position. And in just less than 25 months, you get fired, you go home. In less than two years. So your 10 million is in Akunwa too much. And Ruto doesn't care. Even the person who lobbied for you cannot care. Kwa sababu, yeja likupatia mukamalizana. Ukifutu kazi, that is none of his business. Iyo ni wewe, Na mudosu wako William Ruto. Kuna familia zinaenda kuteseka. Ili ni shoka limewekwa. And by the way, there's something you need to know. The principal secretary is the accounting officer of ministries. They are the people who hire and fire. They are the people who prepare books of accounts. Awa diyo watu wanajua ministry ni gani. Mtai kawe, few days ago, advised some cabinet secretaries and told them, do not just dump that you are now all powerful and you've come to make changes in your ministry. Mtai kawe warned them and said, as a CS you can be all powerful, but a PS can have all the powers. More powers than even you. Let me give you an example. In the previous government, the Jubilee government that was led by President Uhuru Kenyatta, there is one ministry called the Minister of Interior. Kuna jamaa tulikuwa na pale, alikuwa na itua PS Kibicho. Kibicho was government and government was kibijo. Even if we saw Matiangi an all-powerful CS, in fact, kibicho was ten times powerful than even Matiangi. That is how ministries work. A principal secretary can own all the powers. Na kama CS, hawezi yata inua kichua. Ruto can bypass you and they release information to the principal secretary. It's possible. So, it's true and I agree. A wrong PS is a failing ministry. That is true, and there's nothing you can do about it. But anyway, let's wait and see. We pray for their best. Uh, God bless you. Asante Nisana. See you in the next video. Thank you so much.